Hello friends! Welcome to day 24, 40 inks and 40 days. Today's ink, Today's ink is JFK, JFK. <laughs> Dog Pushinka. Dog Pushinka. Today we're using Pirate Mountain Metro Politan. Politan. With a medium. Medium. Nib. Nib. So Strelka from yesterday's ink had puppies with another dog who was used in many ground-based space experiments, but never went into orbit. And one of these puppies was named Pushinka, which means fluffy in Russian. And Pushinka was given to the Kennedys by Nikita Khrushchev in 1961. Pushinka ended up having puppies with another of the Kennedy's dogs and JFK humorously referred to these puppies as pupniks. And I know I was reading an interesting article about this and they, when was it? It was really not that long ago. There were still several living descendants of these pupniks out there here in the United States. And I'm not sure if there are any living descendants anymore, but that, that was pretty cool. Oh, look at that. Mrs. Kennedy and I were particularly pleased to receive Pushinka. Her flight from the Soviet Union to the United States was not as dramatic as the flight of her mother. Nevertheless, it was a long voyage and she stood it well. And that is from June 21st, 1961 in a letter from John F. Kennedy to Nikita Khrushchev. And there are some really interesting articles out there I read about how the Kennedys and uh, the Russian president were able to kind of connect during this incredibly stressful time in world history and particularly between the United States and the Soviet Union during the Cold War, but they talked about dogs and their love of dogs. I believe, I believe I'm remembering this correctly. So it was just this this interesting anecdote from the time about how perhaps that eased some of the tension between the two world leaders. And if anybody is looking for a band name, I feel like Pushinka and the Pupniks would be an excellent choice. As for the ink, at first, when I first swatched this ink out, I did not think I was going to like it at all. It kind of, you know, reminded me a little bit of Baby Poop Brown, but when I got it into this pen and started writing with it, I found it more interesting. It has very neat shading and I don't know. I don't know exactly what it is about it, but I like it. It's maybe because it's close to some other greens and bronzes and browns that I do really like. So maybe that's why. The chromatography is really cool too. You can see like some yellowy orange, burnt orange in there and very bright blue. So that, that is cool. So there it is, an interesting, green, brown, 
bronze. I'm not even sure how exactly you would classify this ink for today. Cool. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Can I do it again? Okay, one more time. Bye.